happening now. INM power utility crews are on their way to parts of the country devastated by Hurricane Laura. 16 News Now reporter Jack Springgate has more on their effort to help those communities recover. Well, when we had two tornadoes rip through parts of Elkhart and Kosciuszko County a little bit more than two weeks ago, crews from Southwestern Electric and Power Company helped restore power to those communities. Now, Indiana and Michigan Power is returning the favor in the wake of Hurricane Laura. Here's a look at those crews hitting the road early this morning. The Indiana and Michigan Power is going to send over 200 of our employees and contractors to, to the Gulf states to help with the restoration of power there. Uh, it's, it's a form of mutual assistance. After Hurricane Laura tore up parts of the southeast in Texas, the crews will head to Arkansas and Mississippi tonight. Tomorrow, they'll be given more specific directions of where to help. We have people who focus on restoring power and working on lines. There are also forestry people who help uh, remove trees and get them out of the way so, so the lot people can do their work. They'll join others from Michiana, including the Red Cross, who are answering the call to assist in recovery efforts. We're always in a need for volunteers. If, if folks are looking at their television and listening to the radio and watching the news on this disaster, and are wondering what they can do, they can go to redcross.org and sign up to be a volunteer and get their training started to go out and be able to respond to not just national disasters, but the disasters that hit here in Northern and Northwest Indiana all the time. And it's hard to tell how long these INM crews will be down South, but Warner tells me that it could be a couple weeks. For now in South Bend, I'm Jack Springate, 16 News Now.